I'm Hidehiro Fukuyama from Rike and IMS, and I'm working on uh, vaccine development as a deputy team leader. For the COVID vaccine, as well as other vaccine, it's a very universal next generation vaccine that we are thinking of. We still using the classical needle. However, when you think about the situation all over the world, we don't have a needle, we don't have doctors or nurses. So we really have to have the new type of the vaccine, which helps to vaccinate all the people in the world in the same time. For example, a nano needle or a micro needle, which is a kind of putting a sheet on the surface of your skin. That's kind of what we wanted to do. This is really important to immunize in the same time all over the world, what we call the herd immunity. So that's kind of like a concept for the vaccine. So definitely those easy and safe vaccine can help those complicated system to be easier for the society. We focus on uh, you know, material called adjuvant that helps the immune system producing the antibody to attack the viruses. But when we looking at the different adjuvant, we come across the fact that the vitamin D is actually an adjuvant enhancing the immune system. So we kind of interested in those adjuvant. There is a several steps to develop the vaccine. Therefore, we started with the influenza viruses. We made it a really good spike protein, which the virus used entry to the cell and is good for the antigen. And then when we use our vitamin D adjuvant, definitely they induce a high titer against the coronaviruses. So now, what we wanted to do is combine those adjuvant antigen and then somehow the new type of vaccination protocol. I, I cannot guarantee, but uh, within a year, definitely we wanted to start that trial for the animal experiment. That's what we are at right now. According to our previous experiment, well, definitely when you use the vaccine for the influenza, we only use it one time. And then that's already effective for protection from the influenza infectious disease. As long as the vaccine is targeting some of the virus which antibody can block, then if you design any antigen from virus, we can use the same system from virus to virus. We use only changing the antigens. Definitely, Riken is uh, one of the best institute in Japan and its infrastructure and then the human resources, it's really well organized. And without this kind of condition, it's really difficult to have this kind of uh, outcome in a very short period of time.